Hi hey guys, um, today I'm gonna show you guys how to get um, book save on your DS. So let's start off by going to the internet. And yeah, I'm gonna just pause it. I'm gonna just keep on pausing time to time to um, make this video short because um, I really lag and stuff. So yeah, I'm gonna pause. Okay, so when you're here, uh, when your browser's open, type in project pokemon.org and I'm gonna pause it once again. And uh, once you get here, it should be like this. And um, go to PPSEDS. And um, I'm gonna pause once again. And yeah, so it should um, load up here. And um, here's the stuff, like information about it and stuff, and the games that it works on, and the R4 stuff. And yeah, so um, here's where you download it. Just press download. But since I already have it downloaded, I don't need to. And it says that here you need DLDI patch if your cart doesn't automatically. So I'm gonna show you guys how to get the DLDI patch. So go on um, Google and now you type in or for DLDI patch and um, I'll pause once again and once you get here it should be the first one Chisholm I'll probably just leave it into um, the descriptions so you guys don't have to search it up and here you guys and you can get um, it for pretty much anything like for example if I type in ace card here um, they'll look for the ace card on the page, and um, yeah, ace, if there is an ace card, it'll automatically pop up. But we're looking for R4, or at least I am. And to download it, you just go press the DLDI right there. Um, but since I already have it downloaded, I'll just go and go ahead and go into my page. I mean, home page, and just load it up here. And, um,. Yeah, I'm gonna pause once again, and this should pop up and go on output. And um, yeah, you can get two of them: one without music and one with music. And um, what you do here is you have to extract it to your system folder in your R4. And I'm going to load that right now. Um, I can't. Um, I c unfortunately I can't load my card right now, but. Yeah, you have to um, put it into the system folder. Um, I won't make mine. I made mine with music, and you just pretty much put this um, in your games folder. But I suggest you make a new folder called the Homebrew, or something else that you already put your Homebrew games in. And yeah, so I'm gonna just switch over to my DS now. If you guys can wait for a while, for a little while, and yeah.